A warm welcome home this afternoon for an independence police officer shot in the line of duty. After months of recovery, Officer Thomas Wagstaff returned to a community that prayed for his recovery. Today, Officer Wagstaff was awarded the Purple Heart in front of hundreds of community members. 41 Action News reporter Sarah Plake was there for the emotional ceremony. It was a packed house here. Folks from around the community thanking Officer Wagstaff for his service. It was a ceremony that moved just about everybody to tears. Many will say this is a miracle. Independence police officer Tom Wagstaff sitting and at times even standing before the community at a ceremony in his honor. The community here, all our friends, family, strangers, you guys are the reason that we are still here today. Officer Wagstaff's family speaking publicly for the first time in eight months after their lives changed forever. Last March, Officer Wagstaff responded to a home burglary. An ensuing shootout occurred and I was struck in the head by a ricochet from one of the bullets. The doctors told us to plan for the inevitable, but I kept thinking, you don't know my Tom. You don't know his will to survive. After extensive rehab in Nebraska, he's finally home, welcomed back in a special parade on Friday. On Saturday, city officials recognized his strength. Thank you for taking personal risk on behalf of my community. And in his own words, Officer Wagstaff thanked his family for helping him through. They are my true inspiration to get through it all. And all of you just for your prayers and continued support. Even with a little humor. I would like to thank the Centerpoint Hospital's medical staff for keeping me alive. <laughs> Officer Wagstaff was awarded the Purple Heart for his service, a day that could have taken his life. Officer Wagstaff still has a lot of recovery left. He said right now the most important thing for him is being there with his family. In Independence, I'm Sarah Plake, 41 Action News. Quite a special day in Independence today. You can watch the full Welcome Home event for Officer Wagstaff and yesterday's homecoming parade on our Facebook page and on our website, KSHB.com.